guys, Fleur here with another episode of uh, Road to Glory. This will be episode three. And after winning the state championship and celebrating with some friends, I'm just going to be driving around th thinking about what I'm going to do, where I'm going to go. I mean, you know, if I'm going to play at first, how long is it going to take to be a starter might be a factor do should I stay near home or should I get away and that's what I'm doing right now I'm driving back home to my house so I can have a talk with my parents so that we can talk about whether or not they care if I stay near home or if I go away but I'm pretty sure it won't matter and uh, I'm going to be talking to my big brother, too. He'll be there. My big brother, Damon Morris, he'll be at the house. He came home for a day. He has an off day from his baseball. And I don't know because, I mean, a lot of people are worrying about the coaches' trust stuff. I mean, the coaches' trust isn't that bad. I play on All-American. It is not as bad as people are saying it is. It, I mean, it makes it more of a challenge, but I mean, the only thing I don't like about it is if you lose one yard on a play, it'll give you minus 10. It's like, I don't know, it'll give you minus 10 if, like, all your guys don't even block. <coughs> ah. So, ah. just thinking, man, uh, I don't know, should I stay in Michigan? I like that field playing on it and uh look at these crazy drivers. <laughs> As I was saying, I like that big house. The big house that was nice playing on for the state championship game. Should I stay there? I don't know, man. But uh I just gotta go talk to my parents because they are a big factor in where I'm gonna go. And well I mean I mean, I'm going for a good storyline too. Not more, not the st a storyline, but like uh, so, like a factor where I'd be a key factor, where it'd be a good idea. Yeah, more like that, where it could be, where I could be some a little bit more creative. But ah, uh, yeah. Um. So uh, I'm about to get home. I'm almost there. And my parents, they they said before, like before the championship game, they said that no matter what, wherever I go, they'll still support me, even though they probably want to see some of my games, like go. I mean, I would probably buy some tickets for them, but they aren't, they aren't going to be drive, able to drive all the way from Michigan all the way to faraway places. Depends where I go. Depends the schedule. But... They always support me. My parents, Austin Morris's parents are good. And you see, right now, we're driving in here. Our, my house is off to the left. Nice little, it's not really an apartment, but it's a little house. It's a nice house. So <laughs> I'm just trying to park right here so I can go in and talk to them. All right, so I'm parked and gonna go talk about where I'm gonna go with my parents alrighty and I'm gonna hop out my car alright so after a long talk with my parents I have made my I've made my decision as you see it sh shows like fourth string third string second string first string uh, first string for Miami University but I'm not gonna go there and all the other ones are third and fourth, and then Stanford is second string. So, and I, I don't know. It depends what, like, a spread or air raid I'm probably not going to go to because I'm a running back. So, I don't know. It's either between Michigan, Stanford, and Boise State, maybe even Virginia Tech. But I do make my decision in this video. Oklahoma would be nice to go to, too, but they got, what's the name? So, I'm just taking a long look long looks at these teams that but I have already made my decision after a long talk with my parents and 
just going to say they really are okay with my decision because it's a good school. It's a good school for academics. And right there, Stanford. I am now with Stanford Cardinal Austin Morris. And it says he'd be on second string. And number 28 is taken, so I have to find a new number. And I go with uh, number 20. So now Austin Morris is at Stanford Cardinal. Spark rating 110. Alrighty, so that is going to start my college career packing bags. Yeah, I, I don't know. There's a game, I think, on the schedule that's close to Michigan. I could get my parents over there into the, at the game. And driving to school in my car. <laughs> All right, so looks like the first game will be against San Jose State. That should be a nice game, pretty nice. And, you know, practice just to get up in the depth chart. I'm not going to show practice. I'll show position battles, but I'm not going to show practice. And right here, I am going to go look at this depth chart. And when I got here, I was like, what the heck? Because it says I'm fourth on the depth chart. And I don't understand that because it said second string. But I don't know. I guess I'm guessing maybe you have to be fourth string no matter what. Because it said second string. That would have been nice to be second string because then I would have got playing time a lot my freshman year. So now that I'm only four string, uh, freshman year might be kind of boring. You're not going to see a whole lot, but I am going to show every game. And I am going to be the kick returner and punt returner. So that's all right. I'm okay with that. And hopefully by my sophomore year, I'll be starter. But, I mean, it makes it more realistic, I guess, even though it said it'd be, I'd be second string, but it put me at fourth string. But now look at my skills. Overall 79, speed 86, acceleration 82, agility 82, awareness 70, break tackle 76, carrying 84, trucking 66, elusiveness 85, BC vision 71. These are some pretty nice attributes. I like that 86 speed. Strength 69, catching 76. And I don't know, I just kept scrolling up and down. All right, so... Uh, Stiff arm 72, spin move 75, juke move 84, route running 70, impact blocking 69, run block 70, pass block 74, stamina 85, and injury is sitting at 79. So I might, I don't know, that looks like I might get injured if it's at 79. Hope, but, I mean, you can uh, buy them packages, skill upgrades. And I'm going to go to the preseason polls right here. Uh, of course, Alabama number one. And I'm going to look down, and Stanford, my team, is ranked 20th in the preseason polls. So if we go undefeated, we could probably go for a championship, but I don't know. If we lose one game, it depends. But as you can see, we're second in the Pac-12 nor North uh, Conference lookout and or outlook, and third overall in the Pac-12. So hopefully that would be nice to come home with a Pac-12 championship. And uh, the Heisman watch. Now, I don't know why, but I do have named rosters, but for some reason they weren't named in here. But it's not that big of a deal. That's Matt Barkley in first. And then that's Monty Ball, Tyron Matthew, Matthew, and Denard Robinson, and Landry Jones. And so, uh, sorry about it. not named rosters. I will have named rosters in all my other series that I come out with. This one just, like, didn't save it or something. I don't know. But, yeah, this is going to wrap up this video. I hope you enjoyed. Please leave a like and subscribe for more with my first college games coming out in the next episode. Peace. Have a good day.